Football Manager 2023, Charlton player ratings, bruv. Shout out Tarek Amazing, yeah? Um, cool. This one's for all the London man, the big up all the London man, them, yeah? All right. Nicknamed Addicts, all the cities love the club. No constant of competition because we're in flipping League One. Man, I'm, I'm not too far from Charlton. I used to play for them, but probably under 10s or under 11s. And it wasn't actually Charlton under 10s. It was probably, it was called Junior Reds, yeah? I was there. Man was an outfield player. I was a, I was a wavy baller, but I never had the mentality. So they made me a goalkeeper. Probably I was terrible outfield, yeah. Made man a goalkeeper. Then then I just never heard from them again, ever. They never they never called me back to training. I was I was terrible. I ain't gonna lie, but man was definitely playing for Charlton at one point still. Charity thing. So. Anyway, um the history as you can see is quite nasty. Um the last time they were in the Prem, correct me if I'm wrong. Two oh wow, oh wow. Two thousand and five, yeah. Drop me out, mate. Alright, for this couple going from Joe Wolakot all the way to uh Daniel Kanu. Let's see what they're saying. Let's see who's a signable gem. You get me? Let's get into it. All right, first of all, we've got his man like Joe Wolakot, bruv. You get me? Man doing up the Ghanaian thing. Big up, big up all the Ghanaians. Anyway, 4 me flexes, 15 agility, 12 one-on-ones. You know what? For the, for the league one, my man will accept that for where it is. He's a goalkeeper defender. He's an honest man. You get me? That's, that's a bonus right there. Obviously, mentally, it's a disaster, but at least he's brave, innit? You get me? So, yeah, I'm apart from a lack of, a lack of one-on-ones, He's decent for championship, I'll give it to you. Man, like Joe Willacott, you can get a little tune out of him in that league. Yeah. All right, the backup side. Oh, my. Oh, my God, bro. All right, cool. He's 22, yeah. 11 reflexes, 10 agility, 9 one-on-ones. Dusty! Dusty! And lastly, for the goalkeepers, we've got a 29-year-old, Craig McGillivray. All right, saying that. And 30 reflexes, 14 agility, 12 one-on-ones. Um... Man claims sweeper keeper defend. Where's the first touch? Six. Nasty. Anyway, um, eight composure as well. Nasty. And yeah, where's the positioning? Twelve. You know what? Um, if he's a backup in this league, fair enough. You will never use him when signing him though, starting wise. But man will definitely have him on the bench because that's what he is. He's a backup, innit? Side man. All right, let's see what man like Ryan Ennis. Imagine if you put a P at the beginning of his surname. Anyway, um, twenty-seven. Yeah, seven techniques, seven vision, and eight passing. He's meant to be a footballer. Are you kidding me, bruv? And then, and they're going to try and tell me that he's meant to be a tackler of the ball. The guy's 27, he's got 11 tackling. Drop me out, mate. That's the... You get me? I know he's got 16 strength, 17 jump. So basically, he's similar to Dwayne Johnson. Not a, not a footballer, but a bodybuilder, innit? The guy's 6 foot 5, he's strong and he can jump. That is it. Dusty. All right, next we've got a 26-year-old Terrell Thomas, bruv. All right, so central defender. The man's got 9 technique, 9 vision, 10 passing. He's 26. Say nothing. Um, 14 jump preach, 13 heading. That's very good. 12 strength, man. Need to work on that. He's a centre back. Cool. Um, under pressure, he's got that 13 composure. What's the tackling? 10. Oh, oh my God. You're 26, bro. What is he doing? Nasty. All right, and this you've got a 25 year old, Sam Lavelle. Well, you're not levels, bro. What kind of line, man? have to change the name, bro. You're not levels. You're dust. You're dusty. All right. Central defender, nine technique, eight vision, nine passing, and you're 25. Really. Um, 14 heading, 14 jump reach is amazing. 14 strength, amazing. I ain't gonna lie. He's got no positional ability, but the tackling that could definitely improve. But he's he's 25. He's a fridge player, like a magnet man's just chilling there, collecting dust, bruv. But he's not starting. And on the bench, it's probably a myth, myth as well. I ain't gonna lie. Moving on. Next, we've got my like Mandela. Eggball, bruv. All right, so um, Mandela Eggball is a wing back on support. He's got nine technical ability, seven vision, and ten passing. So uh, how you can support someone when you can't see what you're doing, only Lord knows. That's like a driver, a bus driver, that is literally blind, bruv. How are you gonna support the man them dropping them to school and that if you can't see what you're doing, bruv? You get me? So you're meant to be a support role. Clearly, you can't support anyone. So now I don't trust you, innit? And now I, def I definitely can't play you, especially if the fact you're 24 and your tackling is 11. You get me? Big man! And you can't even win the ball nor see the ball. Good luck, bro. Man's playing like he's playing in the dark. You get me? <laughs> Good luck. Yeah, good luck, man, them. Big up all the London, man, them. This, this, is, this one's for you, innit? Hey, bro. I hope you're seeing this right now because it's bloody dusty, bro. This is what we deal with, though. Um, not everyone can... You know what? Moving on. All right, next we've got my like Sean or Sheen. You get me, man like Claire. Say that in 25. Um, 13 technique, 8, eight vision, 13 pass. And I'm looking at that picture. I can see where they say 8 vision, bro. I'm not gonna... Anyway, um, 13 pace, 11 agility, 14 acceleration. It's decent, but no no, no side to side movement. He's a straight line right winger. And 12 dribbling, 11 flare. 
He's got a decent pass to him finishing 11. Still dusty, um, but looks like a squad player. I ain't going to lie. He looks like a squad player, innit? I ain't going to lie to you. Let's move on. This is so dusty. Next, we've got my lad, Steven Sessignon, bruv. All right, so this is the definition of a League One star player. Not in my opinion, based on what the game's telling me. They're saying he's a star player. That means you put him above a, a lot of your of your other players. Yeah, saying that. And what is he offering? 13 technique, 12 vision, 11 passing. All right, so he can't pass. Cool. Um, he's meant to be a wing-back attack. He's got 11 in dribbling and 11 crossing. All right, then. And then 12 flair. He must be like messy in this league. Trust me. And he's got that 14 pace, full energy, full generation. He's rapido, but he does not know how to use his pace with eight off the ball. Good luck. Yeah, he's meant to be your star player. Good luck. Next, we've got my lad, Eogan O'Connell. All right, the guy's 26. He's a ball playing defender. He's got 12 technique, 11 vision, and 13 passing. Cool. Um, eight pace, 10 agility, 7 acceleration is dusty, but man's got 13 positioning in this league. I'll accept that for what it is. Uh, mentally, he's having about 12 in the areas that I need. I would accept that because man's literally feeding for scraps like right now, like I'm a bloody mouse. Ratatouille and them man there. And yeah, man, 14 tackling. This guy is world class in this league, bro. I'm not going to lie. He's elite. He's an elite centre back for the League One. Don't you dare bring him to the Premier League getting biased. But in that League One, man can mash some work still. I'll be honest. He's a very good player in this league still. Yeah. Next, we've got a 24-year-old, George Dobson. Yeah, say nothing. All right, so you know what? Let me tell you why this guy is world-class. It's the fact that not because he hasn't got that technical ability, which is dusty and his 10, yeah. It's the fact that he's brave. At least he he knows, like, he doesn't fear no one but God, in it. So that's what I rate about him. Man's brave. Therefore, he's world-class, in it? And that's why I'll sign him for my Man City saves. Start him as well, because George Dobson, he don't fear no man. Yeah, fears no man will draw blood to anyone on that pitch, bruv, as that dusty bull in the midfender on, on, on the fender row. But I don't care. You get me? Have fun. I'll sign him now. I recommend that signing. What a gem. He's brave, yeah? Next, we've got my lad, Jake. Four-star Kaski. All right. Um, swap the A for the O, and then you got Cox. Hey, never mind. Um, 11, 10, 8, 5, 12, passing. Dusty! Anyway, you know, the technical ability is a bit... It's a bit dusty, but the vision is not that bad. The passing could improve. He's 20. Oh, he's 28. Why did I read that? Why did I read that as if he's 23? He's 28. 3 and 8 look so similar. Oh, I've lost all hope then. At least he's got off the ball movement. Um, He's not moving anywhere with the off the ball movement because he's got 10 pace, 10 agility, 11 acceleration. Um, Finishing 9. Oh, my God. Hey, good luck. He's a box-to-box -box midfielder. Mentally... It is disastrous, but I mean, maybe for this league, 10 is like 20 in this league, maybe. You never know. Maybe I've been looking at this thing wrong the whole time, bro. But um, yeah, good luck. Next, we've got Mr. Frandles. I mean, Connor McGrandles. All right. Um, box to box midfielder again. Man's got 10 technique, 12 vision, 12 pass since. Say 9 and 11 first touch. He's 26. Dusty. And he's got 11, dis oh, 11 decisions. And you're 26, bro. Um, can he shoot? No. Nine finishing, eight long shots. It just got worse and worse. And he dictates tempo for why? What can he, what is, what is he doing? Dictating to 12 composed 11 decisions and he dictates tempo. What? Um, 10 to 12 vision, 12 passing. You know what? Yeah, he's probably world class in this league anyway. I'll let it slide, bro. Man like McGrandles, sign him now. See. Next, we got my like Charles Clayden. All right, so who forced this guy to play football then? That's what happened. You, you know that Project Mbappe child that you forced your son. Your son probably didn't want to be a footballer, but you forced Project Mbappe on him. This is one of those players where their dad was like, listen, you're the next Mbappe. I don't care if you're rubbish. I'm paying for all of your drills. I'm paying all of the referees just to go on your side. You have to be a footballer. I don't care. Any other position, profession, I'm not going to be a proud of a proud dad. And and unfortunately, this is this is one of them situations. My man, like Charles Clayton, he's... he's He's so dusty that I'm looking... He is coated in grey numbers. Coated in them. You get me? They're scattered everywhere. Man's got free strength. You you as much as flick him and you can finish his career, bruv. You get me? Dusty. Dusty. Next, we've got my like, be Morgan, this is your number 10. This should be your tallies, man. Let me see what he's saying. All right. 22. But, you know, I just saw that he's a fringe player and he's your number 10. What are you dealing with? Change the numbers then. But anyway, he's got tries killer balls often. Nah, that's just his first touch. That's misleading the traits thing. You get me? He doesn't try killer balls often. He just can't control the ball. Anyway, um, 13 technique, full envision and 13 passings. Very good for this league. That's world class. 11 first touch, like I said. Dusty decision making, 10. Dusty, 9 composure. Dusty, 13 dribbling and 11 flare to flare. Dusty, but you know what? Um... As a player in this game, not even a Mazala. Just make him a little advanced playmaker and support, or dare I say it, make him a central midfielder on 
flipping automatic and make him just run around and collect dust, rude boy. Say. Next, we've got my lad Scott Fraser. Yeah, saying that in 12 technique, 12 vision, 11 passing. Um, he's meant to be a cam. Yeah, he's got 11 dribble and 11 flair. Good luck with that, bruv. Um, 11 pace, 11 acceleration, and 11 off the ball. Safe. Anyway, 12, 12 first touch, decent. Can he shoot? Not really. 11 long shots, fair enough. He's an advanced playmaker. He makes the right decisions. He's got no end product in terms of passing. His dribbling is dusty. I ain't trying to see that on live TV. But you know what? He's probably worth a mil for you to sell him. And if you can sell him for a mil, take that and run, yeah? Run. Don't look back, bruv, because you'll be robbing them. Man there, you get me? Next, we've got my lad Jack Payne, bruv. You get me? Man brings the pain with 11 decisions. So man's trying to rob the bank, trying to bring the pain to the man them. But he's got the he's got the gun pointed at himself, bruv. That's that's what eleven decisions does. You get me? He just doesn't know what he's doing. Man, almost assassinated himself. <laughs> man said you hired a hitman, and the hitman committed suicide instead of finishing the target, bruv. <laughs> that is what Jack Payne is. That's the pain he brings. Cause when when man's in front of goal, yeah, he doesn't know what he's doing, bruv. Like you know what? Twelve technique, twelve vision, thirteen passing. Pretty good, can't lie. Can can he use it though? No. Thirteen dribble and fourteen flat is actually one of the best that I've seen today. It's actually very good, bruv. And I appreciate that, therefore I say he's world class, you get me, amazing player, amazing footballer, sign him now, you get me. Next we've got a 24 year old Charlie Kirk, saying that a man's either footed, yeah, 12 dribbling, 13 flair, look at that unpredictability, that unpredictability, man's spinning up anyone in this league, yeah, saying that, and 12 pace, 13 energy, 12 acceleration, it's kind of slow but 11 off the ball, oh, that didn't help, that didn't help, anyway, 12 technique, 12 vision, 13 passing, man can be a... I was about to say head up winger, but he's got 10 composure, 10 decisions, and he's 24. So, you know, he'll still be head down, but man can pass the ball in it. You get me? Have fun. All right, next we've got my lad, Corey Blackett Taylor. Oh, my God. What a name. And what a way to label the man them on the ends, bro. I'm not I'm not happy with that name, bro. I ain't going to actually know you. How can I say that? Who do you think you are? You can't say that. That's man's name, bro. You get me? But still, that's... It's a, bit, it's a bit suspect that I can't, hey, you know what, it's way too political for me to continue that subject. Let me just look at these stats. Oh my God, they're so dusty. I was very off talking about that subject, bro. I ain't going to lie. He's, at least he's fast though. But um, six six vision, yeah? Six vision, bruv. He's covered in greys, but he's fast. So man, we'll use him in it. You get me off the bench. He will be the new Mbappe. You get me? In this league anyway. You know the ones there? He's so dusty though in this game. They're not rating your thing, bro. I can't lie if I am. Jeez. Next, we've got my lad Dilian. <laughs> Dilian J. <laughs> All right, bruv. Hey, bruv. I <laughs> said they're telling me to dial in to Jayasemi. What are you saying? You want me to call this guy so he can start for me? <laughs> the only reason why I call him is so I can release him. I'll dial in to release Jayasemi. That's what I'll be doing, bruv. Man be dialing in to release him because he's very dusty and he's covered in greys once again, bruv. 11 first touch. Dusty! Have fun, man them. Man like Jay Suran Rek Segi is next and he's basically translated from gibberish to play me, I sack you. Because <laughs> that's what happens, isn't it? If you play this guy, you're most likely going to get sacked because he's not going to do anything and he's just going to be collecting wages and doing absolutely nothing on the pitch leading to your sackment because if you're not doing anything on the pitch the board are going to look at you like what's this guy doing they're going to get rid of you innit? and that's what this guy is basically warning you play me i sack you that's what happens yeah have fun all right next we've got my lad chucks aneki all right say nothing um he is a striker he's a trequista say nothing man's a trequista he's got 12 dribbling 13 flair i appreciate that he's got strength as well 16 strength not off the ball movement but uh, man's feeding for scraps so i have to accept the fact He's got 12 finishing, 12 long shots, 12 heading. You get me? I appreciate that as well. Then 12 technical television and 12 passing. He's probably their talisman. He's probably their best player, innit? And yeah, based on these stats, he's got that technical ability. Like, technically, he's pretty sound. I'm not going to lie. He will be that guy that carries this team if you haven't got anyone to sign, innit? But he's one of their better players. Man, like Trek Wistar, yeah? Chucks Aneki. Have fun. Next we've got my lad Jaden Stocky. I remember this guy, bruv. Is he is he the same dusty baller? Oh hell yeah. <laughs> my lad Jaden Stockley, at least you know what? I think I probably said this last time. He can't play football, but he's very good in the air. He's world class in the air. Six foot three, sixteen strength, sixteen jump reach, and sixteen heading. In the air, world class. But when we're actually, you know, playing football, what what man's paid to do? Dusty. <laughs> you get me? Dusty. 
All right, let's see what we're like. Miles, Leah Byrne. All right, so um, 9, 10, 8, 9, vision 10, 10, 10 parts in, boy. Have fun. Let me not waste any more of your time. But you know, he's 18, send him out on loan. Don't release him straight away. You get me? Oh, my God. He's six foot four and he's 18. Nah, start him. Start him, bro. All right, let's see what we've got. Oh, wait, no. The last player we've got is a 17-year-old, Daniel Kanu. All right, so, yeah, this guy you loan out because he's six foot four with five strength. Wow. All right. Talk about a, a human lamppost for real this time. Because literally, you pass him the ball. Man's got amazing technical ability, but five vision and seven passing with five strength. Good luck. Yeah. Safe. Happy Halloween, by the way, because that is a scary team. That team will give you nightmares in terms of the stress that they will cause you. Happy Halloween. And this is how I'm lining up Charlton for my first season, isn't it? I'm so... I ain't even going to lie, yeah. Damage limitation, yeah. Damage limitation. From what I've just seen, man's using roles I would have never used before. And, um, yeah, man's using a formation I would never use as well. A mentality that I would never use. Called park the bus, bro. You get me? Literally, all you can do right now is just hit man on the break. I ain't going to lie. Use the pace that you have out wide. The strength that you have up front to hit man on the break. Long ball it up to your strikers. Lump it up in the air. Hope for something. It's that Burnley ball. That's what you're going to have to play. Good luck, bruv. And yeah, um, goalkeeper. Fair Mac Villarey. You get me? Sessignon on that wing back thing. Man like Innes and O'Connell, the two wide centre backs. And then central defender in the, in the midfield. Oh, wait, I actually put them all central defenders. Doesn't matter. They're all dusty. Thomas covering. Eggbo on that left hand side. Good luck. Anyway, um, Forster Kasky as a defensive midfielder. I don't know what man's doing there. Dobson, defensive midfielder. I don't, I don't know what man's doing there either. And then I've got McGrandles. <laughs> Central midfielder on support, you get me? And then deep line forward on support. Nah, 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 nah. It has to be a target forward still because he's only good in the air. Yeah, make him a target forward. And then an AK, he is, he's your best player still. He's a Trequi star, but man made him an advanced forward because I can, innit? You get me? And I don't give a damn. Man like Charlton. Good luck, man. Then. And that is Charlton. Player ratings for Football Manager 2023. Obviously, that's going to be a struggle save. But it's going to be a, what am I going to call it? It's a challenge, isn't it? It's a challenge. So, yeah. Big up everyone that's taking on that challenge. Big up everyone that is, I'll say it one more time, taking on that challenge because that is a hard team. I'm not going to lie. Like, you've got a long way to go still. But, yeah, man. Um, my, my message with Charlton still. Big up all the, all the London man. Them, that one's for you, innit? it? Hopefully. I was about to say, London, stand up. But I can't say that because they kind of let man down step wise. They're all dusty. So now I have to go to a Crystal Palace to say, to tell the man they have to stand up, bruv. But yeah, you lot, um, if you like that video, like that video. Shout out to Eric, amazing. Subscribe to the content you know what to expect from me, and I'll see you in the next episode, bruv.